What's up, guys? We're loading into a hard hat hard point game. Uh, I think I got a special one for you today. I've been uh, been looking around and trying to find some good classes to try out, and I stumbled upon the M4, but they made the M4 into a submachine gun. Um, I don't know how good this is. This is actually my first game uh, trying it out, but uh, I, I saw it and I was too I was I was hard interested. Point. Am I the only one on my team? I was I was too interested. I ha I had to see if this gun could actually uh, be good. We have our first target. Come out. We got completely ah, shredded. Reloading. <laughs> Dude, the mag size just is what gets me every time. Captures the objective. The magazine size is so small. Got the hard point. Damn, just... Oh man, this gun. This isn't too bad. I mean. If you're gonna actually use this like a uh, like a submachine gun, I mean, you might actually have some fun with it. I don't know if it'll be able to compete with like a standard M4 class, but like I said, we're trying it out. This is the first one. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna struggle against these M4s, but I mean, this will be a good test for the gun. I think so. You know, uh, trying it out as an M4 class or as a submachine gun. Man, definitely get shredded at range with this. But I think this is a pretty fun class to try out. They're already rotating. Yeah, I mean, the M4 is already so good on its own. Why would you, you know, try to make it a, a submachine gun? You know, that, that's kind of the whole thing. Um, I came out with an M4 class set up the other day. And uh, I said you should use that class because you can run around and pretty much do the same thing that I'm doing right now. But just wanted to try this out and see if it was worth it. You know, three piece in a mutt. Or peace? You know, any more? Any more want to step Medical up to the plate? See if they can kill me? Alright, you again? Getting a little frustrated, I, I hear. Just makes you play worse, man. God, I'm just piecing them up. They have no chance. This is actually pretty viable, I have to say. I don't know if this is better than the uh, 5, but... Oh, you're lucky. You're lucky I ran out of bullets, bro. You know, Mazel Tovs, or whatever those, those are, Mazel Tov cocktails are whatever they're called. They're pretty underrated, I have to say. Like, they are highly underrated. Yeah, we're just trying out this Emporosa submachine gun. I don't expect too much from it, but I mean, it's already over, in my opinion. Like, this class is already... I mean, 70 to 6. These dudes are rotating, which is whack. I hate seeing that, but... Let's see if I hear you can kill this dude. Yup. Oh, I should put down my trophy. I'm going to sit in here. Oh, almost did it to him. Oh, they're leaving. They're leaving. Dude, the the M4 as a submachine gun is just too much for them. They don't know what to do. God, you even hear what it sounds like when I shoot? It sounds so pathetic. God, just piecing them up. They have no chance. Who would have thought this little pea shooter would actually be worth? Oh, that those are bad shots for me. I could have easily took his head off, but those are just those are bad shots. You know, that's actually not a bad strat. Just throw that and then just run down the thing, because people really can't challenge you except for me. Because I'll just run in the fire, I don't care. He's aiming in so fast. Like, the M4 is already pretty busted. Never would have thought a class like this would actually kind of work. Maybe I'll have to hang up the... Uh, they're, they're, they're to the left. Maybe I'll actually have to hang up the, uh, the MP5 for this. Just have a submachine gun M4 class from now on. Wow! Did they all just spawn in there? Actually, I think they did. Oh 
I'm dead. I'm glad he didn't turn on me, because that would have been very dirty. I thought I had to turn off the Xbox for that one. Nope, I have time to reload. I'm on this corner and gun. Dude, what are these dudes doing? They're not even coming for the hard point. I guess they can't. Can I do it? I'm a, I'm a terrible sniper. Oh my god, and I always talk about how sniping so easy in this game. Don't, don't, don't shoot like that. Oh! He almost turned on me. That would have been dirty. That would have been really bad. Yeah, I haven't gotten used to the time to kill with this gun yet. Like I said, this is my first time using it, but uh, I'm having fun. I have to say, this is actually a, a cool experiment. The uh, gunsmith or the creator class, whatever you want to call it in this game, is is pretty fun. I, I think it I think it offers a lot of uh, unique possibilities that other games just couldn't do. Anybody else? Yep. Anybody else? Dude, awesome. He left. He left. He didn't want it. He didn't want the smoke. Oh, he was scared. Dude, this guy. I guess these people are kind of bots, too. But I gotta say, I'm having fun. Oh my god, dude. Turn off your game. Turn it off. Oh. Let's see what we can do. What are you using, dude? What is this class? The Amax is so good. Don't don't put all this garbage on it. People coming in here using like war zone classes and stuff, which I'm not gonna lie, some of them are are valuable. No, no. Oh, and we got a Charver Gunner. We're having a game. We're having a game here, boys. Picked up the scar. Let's see if we can keep her going. Oh, I didn't have no clue where he was. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and pull out. Wow, look at the scoreboard, guys. <laughs> Oh man, it's only four of them though. Kind of feel bad for them, but you know. Oh, somebody's already locked on to me. Where though? I mean, yeah, so that was a quick game. I mean, but I think I'll showcase this this little pea shooter pretty well. Um, I highly recommend trying out this class. I mean, I had a blast using this. Like I said, this was my first game ever trying this gun out. Well, this class variant, so I gotta say, 56 and 12 for the first time I ever used this, that's pretty stupid. Like, I have to say, um, I mean, obviously the dudes on the other team weren't that great, but you know, they were trying at the beginning until I kind of hurt their, hurt their morale. But I'm gonna show you guys this class because because I think I think the world needs to see this. So yeah, for the barrel, go the uh, FF's 11.5 Commando. This is kind of what gives you you know your aim down sight speed and your movement speed. Kind of makes you run around like a submachine gun. You know, I think a barrel is pretty important on just about any gun. Uh, and then we move over to the stock, in which you run no stock. I mean, this is probably pretty, pretty important too to make him like a sub but again the aim uh well rear grip stifled you know standard 
nothing new. You know, uh, aim down side speed, sprint to fire speed, that's pretty important, especially if you're trying to make a subclass. But uh, the ammunition is probably what really makes it a submachine gun, because it converts your ammo to you know, 9 millimeter and 32 round mags. But uh, it ups your fire rate and the recoil control, and it makes it pretty fun to use, you know, run around like a submachine gun. Wow, I can't believe this worked. And under barrel, the commando foregrip, you know, standard as well. Um, like I said, I'm getting really into using the commando foregrip over anything else, just because it offers so much and doesn't really take away anything. It takes away movement speed, but I mean, I run around with a with a commando knife or a combat knife anyway as my secondary. So, I mean, this makes you run double, like twice as fast. But yeah, I gotta say this class was was really fun to use. Um, I never thought the M4 as a submachine gun could actually work. I don't know uh, how well it could compete with guns like the MP5 and the MP7. I mean, I guess some of those dudes were using those guns, but I mean, some of those dudes were using like standard M4 classes, and I was just gunning them, and they had no chance. So I mean, if you have a good shot, I, I highly recommend trying out this gun if you want to try something new, especially if you want to run around like a submachine gun with with an AR. <laughs> Um, or actually to just turn your AR into a uh, into a submachine gun. I had a blast using this gun. I uh, definitely had a blast. Oh, we didn't even throw a charm on. What charm do you think we should use? I don't know. I usually go with the Gatling gun from my other class. Let's go with the gas mask. Or the teddy bear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do the gas mask. Looks pretty dope. But yeah, uh... Uh, leave a comment if you guys want me to try out anything new. Like I said, I'm getting kind of bored of this game. Like, I'm just trying out new stuff, seeing what we can do, seeing what's viable. Because a lot of stuff really isn't. But with the Master or the, the gunsmithing, you know, you can kind of do whatever. Um, you can make most guns pretty broken if you just uh, tinker around with stuff. You'll find out what works and what doesn't. Um, but yeah, we're going to end it here, guys. Leave a like on the video if you liked it. Um, subscribe if you want to show some support. Uh, it always helps. Um, we started this channel a few weeks ago, and uh, we're already at 13 subscribers, which is awesome. Um, we're making strides, you know. Uh, this is something I've been wanting to do for a long time, especially Call of Duty content. Uh, but yeah, um, any support is nice, and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video.